Hi, I'm Austin, the founder of Urban Sadhu Yoga. And this month, August, we're going to be exploring rituals and rituals within our yoga practice. Rituals are something that like some of us maybe don't think a lot about, but actually we really need rituals in our lives to kind of connect to deeper wisdom. But maybe you have some rituals in your life that you haven't even thought of as rituals. Maybe every morning you get up, you brush your teeth, you have a cup of coffee, maybe read the paper, maybe not. Over time, that becomes a ritual. Maybe not a very helpful ritual to tap into deeper wisdom, but it's a ritual. It's a, it's a, a repetitive, something that you do repetitively, that you, um, that you maybe enjoy doing repetitively. So it's, it's not the same as a habitual habit. In yoga classes, we've, we do rituals all the time. Um, Suri Namaskar, our sun salutations, is a ritualized movement. But a lot of times, the problem with ritualization of something is we forget why we're actually doing the ritual. Over time, we can get into a ritual and we just do it because our grandparents told us we should do it, or our parents told us we should do it, or our yoga teacher said, this is what we do and this is why we do it. This month at Urban Sadhu Yoga, we're going to explore the idea of the sun salutation, why we do it, what we're trying to connect to, and what is the real meaning of vinyasa and vinyasa krama within the vinyasa practice. A lot of times people say that vinyasa means flow. Actually, V means sequence and nyasa means to place with consciousness. So it's a conscious placement of one thing to the other. You understand the vinyasa krama at the end of the sequence. Um, so we hope you will join us this month and I will see you on your mat in class.